Recently, and for no reason at all, I asked Mint Mobile's legal team if big wireless companies are allowed to. If big wireless companies are allowed to. Hello everyone, in this tutorial, alright, welcome to the stream, the Giwizaversary stream. I gotta get chat pulled up here on the side. Um, okay, so I've been sent a bunch of games from the viewers, and I'm still accepting them for a little bit. I'm gonna be going through them, one by one. Uh, th this isn't for like the jam or anything, this is just random games. Uh, so... Okay, so this is the first one I got. Um, let's look at it. First one we got is Open the Gate. Uh, do you hear the news? Some people are selling the key to the, to, to the gate. You better start selling materials if you want to see what's behind the door. Hello, Rita. How are you doing tonight? Hope you're doing well. Okay, we're gonna download this. Uh, sorry, unknown. I don't. I don't currently have two dollars on me. I would love to. If the game's good, if the game's good, maybe. We'll see. I wonder if he's in here. Unknown. Uh, unknown cutter, are you in here? Uh, let's get this opened up. You know, thinking now, I probably should have, like, installed these before I started streaming, but it doesn't really matter. Right. It's made in Godot. There's a readme attached as well. Oh, okay, cool. Let's hope this isn't too loud. Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. It was indeed too loud. Um, all right. Tutorial. That's not how you spell tutorial. Okay. Um, use WASD or arrows to move. Shift make you walk faster. Cool. Right click make you change weapons. While left. Make you break. Kill stuff. Man, th this is like some peak writing right here. Wow. Sword can kill enemies. Axe can cut wood. Hammer can break rock. Cool. Amazing. Oh wow. It's pretty cool. Uh, okay. 
fully was paying attention. Uh, uh, fixed house. Okay, cool. Okay. So I got a. Okay. Let's get some Bravo again. Can I go in the houses? No? Okay. Oh. Uh, okay, that's how you change it. Okay, cool. Let's right click. It's really hard to interact with that rock right there. Wants to click on the house. We'll see. I also got a. Oh, uh oh. I just closed the game. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, if you make a game, please don't make escape. Just quit the game. Uh, not not the best idea. I don't think. Could be wrong though. I don't know. Um. <laughs> Okay, cool. I got a Maroon 5 ad. Okay. I gotta post this in my Discord. I love how the the bot that's like supposed to um supposed to like post my stream doesn't work at all. That's cool. Okay, let's move on this now. Can you make a survival sur zombie survival game tutorial? No. I don't make tutorials on full games. Because I don't believe that, that helps anyone. I would definitely, like, fix the sounds on this. Yeah, I don't make tutorials on full games. Because it's just really no point. Oh, what's up, uh, Majestic? How you doing tonight? You know what? Uh, oh, okay, I, I keep... I keep quitting the game. Okay. Alright. Okay, how you doing? I keep quitting the game by accident. Where is it? Okay. We're gonna try a different one. I really like this Hungry Hades one, like how it looks. i look at it. Um. Great. Um. Okay, wait, actually, this is the long, long one. Okay, there we go. Cool. Okay. All right, I think I think we got it. Okay. Yeah. Uh. So if you're in my Discord, if not, it's in the link in the description. Uh, you could send it to Jiwa's Showcase, and then I'll look at it. Have you tried to load a specific scene at runtime in an exported game? The current work. <laughs> We tried uh, to load a specific scene at runtime in an exported game. The current workaround I have is to remove remap from the end of the file. What do you mean by that, Michael? Um, I'm a bit confused at what you mean. Like... I mean, all you have to do, I, I don't, I, I don't know if this is exactly what you're talking about. But if you want to, like, get a specific scene, you just go to project. It's just like project, project settings. And then it's, I think it's in run, you click the main scene. And then if you want it loaded into, like, different scenes, depending on, like, the save, you could probably just have, like, a scene that can, like, determine which scene it's going to go to after that. I don't know if that's what you mean, though. Um, so. Is my audio on for you guys? Oh, I've been thinking. Oh, I've been thinking. Uh oh Yes. Seeking liberty, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, yeah. Awesome, cool. Okay. How could I make 8D sound effects? Uh, so, if you mean, like, the effects that go all the way around your head, uh, just use... Um, just use a 3D audio player. So, like... 
good to hear. Uh, add like a uh, audio player. I think it's called uh, audio stream player 3D. Yeah, this is directional. Um, so if this is like behind you, if this is like behind the camera, you'll hear it behind the camera. Hey, Timothy. Uh, hey, Raftal. Hey, um, uh, every new person that just joined. So, but yeah, for 3D sounds, uh, just put it like have the stream player wherever you want. And then just like you can like just move it around the camera and it'll it'll go like in your headphones like that. Um, automatically. So make sure it's an audio stream player 3D. Not the regular audio stream player, because that doesn't have any direction. Um. Welcome, player. You've been tasked as a Hades personal grocer. Uh, and we'll be shopping at his favorite supermarket. Hello, uh, Marancio. How you doing? Hello, Shadow. Which channel... Should I share my game? Ah, uh, G was showcase. Time is running short with only four minutes. So watch the time. Can you proceed to the checkout with all his items before the time's up? Probably not. Uh, I'll try. Tap on the left, bottom left arrow or press space to view the shopping list. Explore and find aisles, areas. I feel like I had the idea for this game a while back. I just never actually made it. I should make something like this. It'll be fun, kind of kind of cool. It's like a fun little project. All right. How do I how do I move? Oh, are you serious? It's a joy. Come on. Whoever made this? Uh, who made this? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, it's fine. Just so, hold on. Uh. Yeah, um, okay, I can't see your name because I'm in, like, streamer mode. That bugs me. Okay. Come on. Show me the person who made this game. No? Okay. Whoever made this game, uh, could you please add WASD movement? That'd be great. Are you sure you want to pay now? No. Oh, this is the checkout. Okay. Help, please. Failure building with the exception. Uh, I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Sorry, you, I, I can't just magically tell from um, a list of errors. Uh, could you give me some more context on that? Uh, oh, I get what this is. Okay. Okay, so I need Hades Oats. Uh, okay. Do I see anything from here? I don't know. I don't see anything. No, I don't want to paint out. Ah, this is hard to control. Um, okay. It did, but there's not. That's the problem. There's not, though. It just doesn't work. Oh, okay. And, it, and like, my, my, my mouse cursor. Okay, I guess. Right. Uh, whoever made this, I really can't play it. It's kind of unplayable. When you export to AAB, do you mean for, uh... Uh, Android? Is that what you mean? Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I, I, I'm, I, I don't, uh, look at, like, Stack Overflow or something, I don't know. Like, yeah, I can't just tell by the error, um. Uh, as long as it's not a RAR file, yeah. That's okay. How can I make a hole instead of a mesh instance in 3D? Like, dynamically? Or do you want to just, like... Like, just have it be there? Because, I mean, just, like, model it. I actually had to do it, like, in Blender. Hole inside of a mesh instance. Hmm. Let me look. Hold on. Ah. Uh... Um, I 
I'm looking at some videos right now. Oh my god, it's Hyper Game Dev. Hello. Oh, hello, Dark Rosen. Are you also streaming? I feel like I feel like you're also streaming right now. You're just saying hi to me. Wait, look. Are you also streaming? No, you're not. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Hello. Okay, I think this is downloaded. Let's go look. Um, supermarket. Holy. Okay, so someone someone uploaded their game. Yeah, I'm just playing. Um, I'm just playing like viewer games. You can upload yours to GWiz Showcase in the GWiz Stuff category. Yeah. Um. Can I comment in offline so that you can see what's wrong? Can you go to my help GD script channel? Uh, I believe you can get some help there. Awesome. Um, so this game right here, right? Dungeons of Dungeons, Dungeons of Doom. Someone uh, uploaded the entire project files. I don't know if it was on purpose or on accident, but they just uploaded the entire project files. Um, okay. Uh, sure, that's fine, actually. I made something just like this, like, a couple years ago. This is, this is, like, eerily like my game that I made a while back. This is so eerily like what a game I made. This is crazy. This is like just like a game I made. This is funny. This is like just like a game I made a while ago. Like a very long time ago. local okay I don't have any locals to play with but that's cool how do I switch weapons is that is that a thing you could do how do you switch weapons okay uh controls uh equip pistol equip shotgun okay it's it's the keys I got it okay cool Pretty cool. Okay, I like the machine gun. It's pretty OP. Uh, oh, that's cool. We got upgrades. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's do vision. This is really cool. Whoever made this. Please reply. Please reply to what? I really hope this music isn't copyrighted. There's no, uh, there's no option menu. I don't know. Channel link. I don't know what you're saying. In the description, I think. Channel link. I'm a bit confused. Oh, yeah, it's in my Discord. Um, okay. Let's, uh... Let's look for another one. Um, who said that they had just uploaded... Uh, was it Majestic? Yeah, okay, cool. Okay. Space pirates, cool. Um, it's G Wizzing time. Okay. Um, wonder if Cubo's online right now. Let me ping him.
All right, I, I have pinged Kubel. I will see if he wants to join in here. Love from Egypt. Much love from Egypt. Um. Uh, help dash GD script. Okay. Uh. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, I think I'm going to stand up actually here in a bit. I've been sitting all day. So we'll do like a stand up for part of the stream. Oh, this is cool. Hello, uh, Pack Zek. Oh, I think I've seen you before. Welcome in. How do you guys like the thumbnail? I spent like a second on it. I like took a screenshot of my video and I just like went. This is cool. I like this background. You think you'll publish your one game someday? I have published several games. I, uh, I mean, I, like I, I, I've worked on a couple games and I've published one game by myself. Currently working on the Plum games. That should come out, preferably before June. That should that should come out like before June. We'll, we'll see. I, I know, I know. He he just had to he had to come out, out of like pure um necessity. There's no audio in the game yet. Aiming to add the next patch to cool. Awesome. Uh WSD for move oh, okay. Uh it looks like it's fading out. Okay. Uh quick tip, uh don't make that fade out, because I couldn't read it in time. So Also, uh it's really hard to tell that these are in the background. Maybe add like a blur to them. Like the asteroids, I thought that they were like an obstacle at first, I and mean, they're kind of distracting. How do I shoot the rocket? Yeah. Um. Okay, I don't know how to shoot the rocket. This is pretty cool. Have you done Gato's high level multiplayer API? Yes, I have two videos on there. I have two videos on that. Oh, it's just okay. <laughs> it's so hard to it's so hard to play while looking at chat. Uh, over here, plasma. That's cool. It's pretty cool. Bullet hell type of game, like Twin Stick or whatever it's called. Um, yeah, I have two tutorials on Godot's multiplayer API. Um, yeah. This is pretty cool. I do quite enjoy. Uh, it would definitely be better with music. I'm a little trapped right now. Where's my health at? Okay. Is there a way to regen health? I actually don't know. Why am I so OP? I, 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 I think I feel a little too OP, honestly. Like, I'm, like, bigger than these ships that I'm just, like, destroying. It's kind of funny. Oh, okay, okay. I feel like I'm, like, so much better than these enemies. And it's, like, I'm not even trying. Maybe I have more difficulty. I like, difficulty modes. Yeah. No, it's, like, it doesn't, it doesn't make intuitive sense that I can destroy all these guys so fast. This is crazy. Yeah, no, it's pretty cool. I like the art. I don't. I did. Did you make the art? Okay. Okay. Cool. Got it. Oh yeah, if you guys didn't know, my current game, it's not its not that good of a game, I won't lie. It's not that great. It was my first ever game, so it's not that good. Uh, but my first ever game that I released a couple, like a year or so ago, is on Steam right now. It's on the spring, it, it's, it's, it's involved in the spring sale. So you can get it for like 85 cents right now. Uh, it's Little Ninja. So if you want to support the channel, you can go check that out. Or you can leave a super chat here, I don't care either way. But, 
you know, you get a game out of, you know, the scene thing. Oh, I lost. Damn. So I was reading chat. Okay. How about ChatGPT or any chat AI? Because I have an idea to make NPC do things you've told them like Matrix game, but you can improve that more and more to be a good game idea. Uh, I don't know. It seems really ambitious. Not gonna lie. Um, I think also, uh, if you want to hear, if you want to have like unlimited requests to ChatGPT, you have to like pay for that. Um, so maybe not right away. It would have to be like a. It seems like something like a big company would have to do. I don't know if an in, in indie game would be able to do that very well, but I don't know. Awesome. Yeah, let me go pull that up. Uh, so I'm actually not gonna, I'm not gonna be on for when it starts. I will. Uh, I'll probably make a make an announcement or something, but we'll see. Check the other game if you like. Yeah, I will. Um, yeah, we're trying to get up to a hundred people join. Let's go. Come on, like let's get six more people in here. Not not too hard. Let's get, let's get six more people in here. The the grand prize is a box of Cheez Its. Like, come on. Why wouldn't you want to compete? everything you got for that that's pretty that's pretty great um okay let me look at this other game actually i'm gonna go ahead and i'm going to be healthy i'm gonna be a healthy adult and i'm gonna stand i'm gonna stand with a box of cheese it's i don't i don't know i don't know i'll be right back All right, we are back. Um, so yeah, let's go. Let's be healthy, I guess, or something. Awesome. Okay. Let's so where's my mic here? I have to move my chair. Okay. Cool. Let's look. Probably like the desk is like so much like I don't know it has to be like lower so it's like look slightly down but it's so good um I look so tall I'm gonna just up like a little bit there we go okay that's good um okay let's see what we got or is this other game I saw uh I can't find my own channel. Well, I need to like organize my server better. It's crazy hard to find stuff. Um Okay, okay, okay. Uh this game. Twisty Trails. Awesome. Okay. Oh, uh, I download. 6 4 confirm. Uh yeah, I'm actually just 6 foot, but I wish. Okay. I don't know. I don't know how 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 good that would work if it's self-hosted because it doesn't have like a whole lot of power. You know, probably doesn't have like I don't. Know. I don't know. Um. Uh. Okay. Where is this twisty? There we go. 
Yeah, it's just for a game, but like, you know, like, is it is it you know is it good enough for a game? I don't know. I don't know how. I don't. I don't know how it works. Okay. Oh. Settings doesn't work. I'm just saying. Um. Okay. So settings doesn't work. That's fine though. Um, okay, sorry. Uh, level one. Sure. Oh, okay. Cool. This is pretty neat. I wonder how hard it would be to break the ball out of the level with bad collisions. I don't know how good Goodo's collision system is. This is pretty cool. Um. Ah, there we go. Get that first. Can I jump? No, I can't jump. Okay, that makes sense. I'm going to get dizzy watching this. This is great. This is this is the best possible game I could have played while deciding to stand up. This is amazing. I don't know how this could have been planned better. But I'm lit I'm literally playing a game where I am super disoriented consistently. As I've decided to stand up. This is great. Hey, let's go. Yeah, baby. Can I get one? Can I get one? Hey. Thanks for testing. No problem. It's a pretty cool idea, though. Uh, if you could try to make it less pukey i don't know like that's my whole problem is, is is it makes me want to throw up like not 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 like the game but just like it, it makes me really dizzy yeah i was thinking it looked like a sonic game are you in the amazing people what does that mean what's the amazing i'm gonna look it up what's the amazing people i am so glad i didn't pull this up on stream I am so glad I did not pull that up in stream. Oh my god. Don't don't look that up on YouTube. Uh <laughs> so I gotta pull up on off screen. <laughs> you look it up, MK? Yeah, I know. I'm so glad I haven't looked up on a on a different screen. There are devlogs and a whole process of development stream did all on YouTube. Cool. Uh can you send a link to that? I definitely check it out. Try the rest of the levels. Yeah. Uh, hold on. Uh, is it like less dizzy for those? Or is it like the same idea? Oh. Oh, that's pretty neat. Oh, it's so rotate. Okay. I think, I think the more zoomed out is better. I like that it's more zoomed out. I think that's where you need to go with this. I think a fixed camera and less zoomed out. I think that this works way better than how you had it before. Um, this is way better. Yeah, this is this is definitely more more in the ballpark of where I would where I would go with this because, yeah, following the ball is just yeah, it's still a little disorienting, but I think this is much more uh, manageable. Come on, get over the <sighs> right. It's it, it's what do you mean, Illumina? It's it's Bill from Gravity Falls. It's Bill from Gravity Falls. Um, oh, there's a time limit. That's cool. Love these little effects. Reminds me of like Terraria. Come on. Oh my god. You know what this reminds me of? Uh, I'm not gonna be able to beat this because this is really hard, and I don't want to try right now. <laughs> um, uh, hold on. This what this reminds me of? Uh. This reminds me of this. Hold on. I gotta find it. I gotta find it. Uh, has anyone anyone uh, ever played this game? Oops, let me click on that. Has anyone ever played this game? You know, like the one that you have to like roll the roll the ball down the hill, um, like down these hills. You have to like get into like the holes. What's up, Heath? How you doing tonight? Um. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. What? 
What do you mean by sorry? Oh, okay. Yeah, this is what it what it reminds me of. Um, yeah. Uh, okay. Let's look. Dark Rosen is a familiar game, and I, I, I obviously have to check out something made by Dark Rosen. Obviously. Um, hold on. One again. Oh, and, and it's in browser. Much, much appreciated. Move for the Godot Wild Jam. Or this place. Where did this place in the in the Godot Wild Jam? Can I see it? I see submissions. Where did this rank? Hold on. How, how do I see? Bo oh, okay, okay. This is like just happened. Wow, okay, cool. Parasitic Research Society. Uh oh. Woo, this is. Oh, it was laggy. Okay. Uh, can I rotate? Okay, I can rotate with. Okay. Ugh. What is this? What are we? What are we looking for? I can't strafe. I don't like that. Can you make it so you can strafe? Be great. Yes, bean. Uh, the bean I have is like in a box. I have to get it. You need one wood. Oh, wait. you need one. You need wood lice. <laughs> you need wood lice of length one and amoeba of length one. Okay, that needs to show up for a little bit longer. Okay, I got the amoeba. That makes sense. Get the wood. These controls are so hard. Okay, okay, okay. What do you mean? What do you, what do you, what do you, what do you, what are you talking about? Oh. It shows up, it shows up so fast. It's weird. Okay. There we go. I got it. Uh, come on. I just can't strafe. Like, I would be done with this already if I could strafe. Okay. Research 10 complete. What is this? Well, what else do I do? Okay, hello. Alright. Have a good night, MK. Um, okay. What else are you doing this? You need to do it 10 times. Why? Can you make a save and load for time map worlds? Uh, no. What I can do is tell you that we I have two save and load system tutorials, and you could probably use those for that. It should be pretty easy to translate that. Because why? What is your point? Dark Rosen. What is your point on that? Okay. I don't know what you mean by that. Okay. Probably missed the percent sign out. So it should be 10%. I don't know what you're saying. You're just spitting numbers, and I don't know—I don't know what they mean. Um. Oh, a uh, new new MK game, which is like huge. It's like a. Uh, it's pretty cool. Wi-Fi zombies. Play. Please download the game. Okay, I'm gonna download the game. I assume it just gives you a random number. Okay. So, where's the... If I may ask, where's the gameplay? Where's the gameplay? That's all I want to know. Okay. Oh, we're in. Can I? Oh, there we go. Cool. All right. Okay. 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 Cool. 
So where's the gameplay? Log yourself out. Okay. Cool. Dude, I would love to, like, work on it. I, I, I would love to, like, fully develop an MK game. Because, like, they're so good. I'd love to, like, work on it, work on an MK style game with them. They're just so good. Free Wi-Fi. Interact. Okay. I can't hear anything. I don't know if that's on purpose. Find the sword. Okay, cool. Ah. <sighs> Oh, that doesn't work at all. Um, okay. Uh, okay. Can I hit someone? Ah. I can. Okay. Alright. So we went from find the sword to just kill everyone. Because why not? I feel like you can knock on the doors, but apparently you can't. Yeah, it's random. What you get as items and the goal is random for research. Research what? Sorry, I'm just really confused on what the game... Like, why? Okay. That wasn't much. I was a very underwhelming uh, MK game. I said, sad to say. Um, but yeah. Alternating, go behind one of the blue houses and... Oh, okay. It's a lot harder. Okay, you spawn back. Okay. We gotta finish that alien game you worked on. Like, that needs to, like, be finished. Um, I don't know if you're working on that, but, like, the alien game needs to be finished. Okay, um, I don't know, I, I might like it better if it's like a game, I don't know, let's see, let's see. There's a Wednesday, cool, so where's the game, I'm so, I'm sorry, I just like, where's, where's the game? Oh, you use the use the idol. Oh, okay. Like, where where's the? Uh, sorry, I'm just so confused on that. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I I don't I don't know. That's not how you sell broccoli. Also, I don't know if that matters. RNG equals win. Yeah. I just don't get how that's, like, a game, though, really. Or, like, fun. I don't know. Oh, okay. Uh, the broccoli beast is stuck on me. I don't know what that's about. Avoid the broccoli beast. Okay, because reset. Oh, okay. This is a bit more of a game. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. Okay, I got the broccoli beast stuck on me. Okay. I mean, this is this is definitely better than. Yeah, yeah. That's the thing is, is like, there's just no real like game to it. That's my only like problem is there's no like there's something about it that's like a game. Like, all you do is, like, you walk, you collect some random stuff, 
and then like you you drop it off. Yeah. So. Well, yeah, but like I don't know. I don't know. I don't want. I don't want to be too mean about it. But like. You can't you can't get the girlfriend past the past the broccoli. Yeah, I okay. Do we have any new joiners for the for the jam? Can we get up to a hundred? Okay, we're two away. We're two away. All right. Yeah, I know. I just, I don't know. I couldn't. I'm not good at that one. We're two away from a hundred. Uh, also, I don't like the theme. The theme is just kind of like a joke, and like it doesn't really mean anything. By the way, just a heads up. The theme doesn't really mean anything. Um. I'm looking for uh, more games to play. We have 40 people who joined. Awesome. Oh, we have reached 100. All right, W. 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 W is in the chat, boys. What are the limitations of the jam? Like, legit? Like, none, really. You just got to make it G Wiz. And I don't know what that means. So, you are cool as well, Majestic. Um, But... The, the the theme is G Wiz. And I don't know what that really means. I just kinda thought it would be funny. Cause it's for the first year G Wiz anniversary. Um so I don't really know what that means. Um so make it G Wiz themed. Uh and the limitation, uh, I'm gonna announce it very soon. Like right before the jam starts, I think. Yeah. Yeah, so my first video released a year ago tomorrow. Um, so we're at 360. I guess 365 because it is technically a leap year. But, so technically it could be today if you really want to count it as that because it's a leap year. But it, it doesn't. So, tomorrow. It's technically. Technically. But, thank you. Um, I do, I do plan on uh, continuing after this as well so that's that that's that um do we have any more no we were trying to and that's like that's, that's that's where we're peaking we're peaking at 100 all right yes uh 7.6 actually uh hopefully we can get to eight by the end of the month that's the goal i want to get to 10 by the summer that would be pretty cool my latest video like it's got it's it's in like the it's it's in my, one of my top rated videos and I don't know how because like I just wasn't I wasn't expecting it. Grow my community as well. Uh, yeah. So don't take it super seriously. That's kind of my big thing. Is um, kind of treat it as like at least as at, at first or continue. I don't really care. Um like treat it as if it's a fun thing and if you mess up or you say something wrong that someone doesn't like and you lose your community oh so well you know like, like so, so what basically like i kind of just i kind of just like w within moderation obviously but i kind of just like say what i want sometimes um and just kind of be 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 yourself i'm I, you know be myself basically um you know Give us some personality. I talked to Cubel a lot about this, which is a like a co-youtuber that I collab with a lot, uh, because he his channel is very less community driven and much more just like purely off of like his videos is all the real like engagement he gets. So, 
partially. Um, really have a clear idea of what you want your channel to be. Um, and really stick to it. Like, I know that my channel is about short form tutorials, um, mostly. And I have a very unique teaching style. When is the node coming back? We're trying to work on that. That is in the works. We don't. We want to find a new day for it because none of us are available on, on Wednesday. So we're trying to find a new day for it. And we're going to try to stick to it. Uh, no, Dark Rose, not, not, not that node. The other node. Uh, the podcast um, he's talking about. Also, we're at 101. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, baby. Woo, yeah, baby. Okay. Um, but, yeah, so... Yeah, I mean, really have a clear idea of what you want it to be. Uh, don't take it super seriously. Uh, because then people will take you super seriously. And then if they take you seriously, and then you don't take yourself seriously sometimes, um, then they're not going to watch you. Yeah. So don't take it super seriously, basically. Do you like very uninteresting idol games? Uh, no. Sadly, I don't. Um... But yeah, like. No. Uh, like most of my shorts. Yeah. Like most of my uh, shorts are like just jokes. <laughs> like most of my shorts are, are, are just absolutely just, I'm just memeing. A lot of my community posts, just kind of memes. Um. I try to target, so I try to target, like, so what I usually do is I try to do, like, five or so serious videos that are, like, not a joke. Like, they're actually, like, tutorials or, like, a, a, like a different long-form style of video. So I try to do, like, five or so serious videos, and then I do, like, one, like, goofy one. I do a couple, like, I don't know, like, shorts or whatever that are goofy. And it just kind of keeps the, the personality going, I don't know. Like, after Steam Leaderboards, we had Dancing Boy. Um, and then, uh, where else? After Multiplayer Tutorial, we had uh, the IRL How to Remove Food from the Oven, which isn't really a joke. I also did um, I also did a, a stream on me cooking, like, egg burritos or tacos. Um, yeah, I just picked those on. Um, and also, uh, completely luck-based. I don't know why people watch me. I'm going to be perfectly honest. Like, I, I can only assume why people watch me. <laughs> we don't have to get you set up. Um, because I am an adult. The eraser. Um, but yeah. It's not, it's actually not that bad. Uh, it's only like, it's like 900, I think, for like all the new stuff. It's not that bad. Um, like, I'm going to have this desk for, like, five plus years, right? Like, I'm going to have it for, like, over five years. So, like, it doesn't really matter. I'm going to have this stand until it breaks, which is probably going to be a while. Um, I might upgrade the mic eventually. I might get a new mic someday. Doesn't matter right now, though. Um, but. I wonder if I have Cubo's phone number. I don't know, though. My voice is crispy, though. Amazing. Do I have Kibble's phone number? No, I don't. Wow. I really should get that. Someone give me Kibble's phone number. No, I'm kidding. It's a joke. You probably won't give it to you anyways. Um, I would love to uh, start talking about the Plum Games with them. Yeah, so I'll, I'll also, let me, let me show some some news on the plum game so we're currently redoing part, part of the uh part of the networking right we're doing part of the networking over again yeah no problem get some, get some good vibes going um but yeah so right now we're we're kind of optimizing the networking so like we have this new so usually to send a packet we had like our like we had to, we had to put the the packet sending 
that will be in the game, yes. But to send a packet, you had to like we had to like write a function for every single um was it? every single script that used it. So what we do now is I believe it's called packet sender. We just have this class where this will send the packet. This will send all the data. Um this will send the data. And then if I go to the player, uh it will send the data over we found this. Yeah, so packet sender. It just uses it just says packet sender uh, dot new, and then it'll send the packet data. And then if it's unreliable or real reliable, very straightforward. Uh, so this will send all the all the information, and then this information will be funneled into this script, this uh, networking script, and this is where in within this function is where all of the networking data goes. So let's say a player sends his position. It's going to go into here somehow on every single person's computer because that's how peer-to-peer -peer works. So yeah, basically how peer-to-peer -peer works is you have each computer is all connected to each other and like a big net. So like one person sends out their position, they're going to send it out to everyone. And then the other person has their position, they're going to send it out to everyone else. Um, so, and that's why it's free. That's also why it's free because you don't have to pay for a hosting or anything. Um, so great for, uh, so, but there, is, there is the downside of a lot of players. Cause if you have more than like, I think it's like 20 players or so it really slows up because it's dependent on, you know, people's computers really to manage it. But like for 10 people or so, it's perfectly fine. Um, But yeah. Um, feedback is good. Feedback is good on what? Your games? Uh, please make your games feel more like games. Um, no, I'm not. Uh, I'm using Steam's peer-to-peer -peer system. So that's why it's uh, it's purely peer-to-peer. We ever fix that Discord link? You just it was it's fixed. What are you talking about? What do you what do you what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you, what do you mean? It's perfectly fixed. What are you talking about? You mean that you can't click it? You can copy and paste it. I don't know. Fine, hold on. You can copy and paste it. I don't know what you mean. I can see you screenshot Discord. Okay, okay, okay. Do you mean like that? Can you, can you check now and see if it works? I don't know. I, I can't tell. But check if it works now. Can you hear my Shrek impression? No. Because I can do a much better impression of the kid who says, do the roar. I'm much better at that than Shrek. Because I can be like, do the roar! You know? I could do that just fine. You know, I'm not super good at Shrek, but like, did it wrong? I could do that pretty good. Um, so, I won't do Shrek, but I will do, I, what's his name? I think it's like Butterscotch or whatever his name is. Someone clip that if you want. Yeah, it's, it's, it's Butterpants, Butterpants, Butterpants. That's his name. Look at Butterpants Shrek. I think it's the third one. Um, yeah, this guy. I'm sure it does. I'm sure it does. Um, yeah, so the last couple things we need to do is I need to also, um, where, where's this go to? Where does this send the data at? Oh, okay. Uh, main global dot sync. Okay. Main dot global. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, it's a global sync. Okay. Which Godot add-ons do you use? Uh, currently, I'm only using Godot Steam, which I'm actually doing some development for as well. I'm on their documentation, and I've worked on a demo project for them. I've worked. I've, I've worked with a couple of uh, the other devs. I only, I only. I only did like a little bit, but I did. I did work on it. What's happening here? Uh. So I was playing 
some viewer, some uh, some of my viewers' games were kind of out of games at the current moment. So um, it's just kind of like a G-Wiz anniversary stream, the day before the anniversary, uh, because I'm busy tomorrow. So, sadly, I really wish I, I didn't have to do stuff tomorrow, but I am busy tomorrow. Um, so I'll, I'll be like... Posting the, the, the jam announcement. And that's about it. But, yeah. So, currently I use Godot Steam. Which is pretty cool. I like Godot Steam. Um, I've used it for a couple years now, actually. I worked on a few games that use it. So, basically, every single game I've been in Godot on Steam has used has used Godot Steam. Which is two games. Which, uh, you know, is... Oh, can, I, can I do a deep first impression? I don't know. It's not a lot of nickels, but it's weird that happened twice, right? I don't know. That's kind of how it goes. If I had a nickel for every time I released a game on Steam, I'd have two nickels. Which isn't a lot, but it's weird that happened twice, right? Um. Oh, yeah. Uh, my game currently is on sale. 15% uh, off if you guys want it. 15% um, off on Steam. Um, 84 cents. It's pretty good. It goes on for another 40 hours. It's called Little Ninja. I could play it on stream if you would like. It's pretty cool. Pretty fun little game. I made it for a game jam. Uh, that I, I continue working on it after. I did not make it only in one week. Um, but I did work on it. In that game jam. It was for the Brackies game jam, I believe. Godot when Godot. Yes. Have you seen the... Uh, have you seen the, the, the Godot spinning logo that I made? That's pretty funny. Hold on. I made this, like, in Godot. I just posted it. Pretty funny. Um, okay. um, yeah, if you guys want a cool little bite-sized game that I made, um, it's on sale. This is the lowest to let me go. It wouldn't let me go lower than this, which is stupid. I wanted to go, I, I wanted to give like a 99% discount to make it like one cent, but I couldn't. Um, okay. Hello, Murdex. How are you doing tonight? What's that profile picture you got? I can't quite see it. I want to look at it. I view your channel. I won't let me view your channel. That's kind of lame. I'm not gonna lie. I don't approve of that YouTube. That's not cool. Not cool YouTube. I want to be able to view people's channels from my chat. Keep with the nice short, nice and short tutorials. They are genuinely super helpful. When I just need a quick redirect. Yeah, that's like most of my content because they're easy to make and they also help a lot of people. Press right. Wow. Well, okay, you said WoW, but with two capital doubles, d d W's. So that's World of Warcraft. That's not WoW. That's the other WoW. It won't let me view your channel. That's stupid. Oh, go to channel. There we go. Oh, okay. I don't know what that is. I thought it was something else, but I can't tell what it was. Okay. Okay. Um. So I have to do, I think it's a packet sender dot new packet two and then i think that's the new that's the new thing that we're doing um delete that and then do i have send packet anywhere else send packet do i call that nope that's not okay delete cool see getting these nice and clean wow is this better hmm that's a good question i feel like that one's more exciting you know like for one like you 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 pronounce it in a different way that sounds more exciting and also like you don't see it as often so yes it is better thank you uh do you wish okay so long okay um yeah okay what have i been shooting for Oh, wow. Well. I've already been streaming for an hour. That's crazy. That's wild. I gotta... It's like 8.30. Okay. 
I gotta finish this. I gotta finish this uh this lobby area. At least I, I don't know. I might. We'll see. Oh yeah. Does anyone here have like a cool library of like sounds, like stock meme sounds, like sound effects, like ones you would see on a YouTube video? Does anyone have like a library of those? I will pay you for that because like I I need it. I need like a like a like a folder of like stock sounds. So that'd be great for like videos and stuff. I'm not a fan of Godot because the language is being similar to Python. I like Python, but I have to see that you are good with it. Yeah, I mean, I'm okay with Python. I, it's definitely the, the one of the easier languages. I feel like, like it's not super hard to get used to. Um, I mean, so, um, but um, yeah, uh. I could definitely use Go. Sorry, there's like a sound outside. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Um, but I use, uh, I mean, I use Python and stuff for uh, like lead code and like technical interviews. Um, if you're a software engineer, you would know what those are. Uh, but yeah. Guys, we're about to reach 500, 500, sorry, subscribers now. 500 uh, members on the Discord. Can we get this up to 500 like tonight? That'd be crazy. That would be wild if we can get this up to 500 people tonight. We're so close. We are so close to 500. Like, can we can we do it? Is everyone here in the Discord? Oh my God. Murdex, Murd Murdex the goat. Murdex is my boy. Um. Amazing. Wow, we're so close. We're so close, guys. We're so close. It's probably going to drop off like crazy after the jam because that's what it always does. We always get like a bunch of people for the jam, then it like completely drops off. Um, But yeah. And for Lua, why? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, but to be fair, I would prefer any language above Python. Yeah, I mean... So the thing is, the only reason why I use it is one for Godot, because I like Godot, so I'm willing to use it for that. Um, two, if I want to get a project just done fast, like for instance, I'm working on a I'm working on a full stack project right now for my portfolio, and there's no real reason to use for for like what I'm doing with it. There's no reason to not use it. Um, yeah, I gotta show you guys that soon. I'm currently working on like a like a cool little side project um, in Python and like web web stuff um so i use it for that and then the only other thing i would use it for is uh like leak code like doing technical interviews because they don't care what language you use there because they know that you could probably use a different language you just chose to use python because it's easier to write in quick succession i mean like uh like technical interviews in general are usually like pseudocode so it doesn't even really matter um but it's usually like python pseudocode um so it's not too bad um but yeah so like yeah i mean that's it's that's like the three things i would use python for yeah no i know i i get it yeah no problem i i i, I get what you mean um but yeah like it's not too bad um like, I'm not going to be one of those guys who's like, oh, you don't use C++, loser. Um, but C++ is definitely great and super useful. But, like, there's a lot of things nowadays that, like, it's just not as necessary. Um, or, like, C. I mean, C++ and C. Um, or, like, just, like, lower level languages in general. I don't know if, like, Rust qualifies as that. Um, but, yeah, definitely languages like that um, are great. And are good for like big products. I think if you're working on like a, like a really big, big application, you know, you need to use like C plus plus or C. Um, but if you're but if you're just like doing like a quick little fun project, it doesn't matter. Um, it doesn't like, yeah. You still playing viewer games? Uh, if you want to send yours, sure. Um, or if you're already someone, let me know which which one it is. Um, can I take a break right now because I don't have any more to play. Um, but if you want to send yours, that's that's fine. Um, yeah. 
I'll be right back. Uh, if you want to send that, I'm going to grab a drink and then we'll play that and we'll see we're going after that. Yeah, so if you go to um if you go to uh in my server, if you go to um Gwiz, if you go to Gwiz showcase, just send it here. And I'll play it. So um what's your project like uh think with games? I'd like to see that. Is it like a game that like helps people program? Is that what that is? I remember there was like a Mindstorm one that was out when I first started getting into programming. What is the time, sir, please? Uh, that's, 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 that's definitely a good question. Cause like I'm currently in CST, but I kind of run by EST. So for my preferred time zone, it's 9 35 PM. Awesome. I'll go check this out. How can I send my game? That is uh itch to IO. Just upload it to itch. It's, it's free. Um, or GitHub, or yeah, or, or GitHub, but preferably itch. That's up to you though. Cool. What about Atlantic Ocean time? Okay, I don't know where that is. Where where is that? Like in the world? You made a game maker studio to it. Cool. Okay, I'll check it out. Yeah, that's what I'm careful about. That's why I don't accept RAR files. Um, if you upload a RAR file, I, I just like, uh, like, even like for my jam, I just don't accept it. I'm sorry. Um, simply because, you know, I, I, I can't see what's inside of it. Yeah. Um, hold on. No problem. Um,. You'll double back and see nice. Uh, okay. Alright. Ah, it's saying it's a virus. I don't know. Alright. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I've seen a game like this before, I think. Oh, hold on. What is it? Sorry. Oh, what? I'm a bit confused. I won't lie. Wait. Let me look at this page. Okay. Um, wait, so Chaos Circuit is a game where you navigate on the bounds of an outlined circle. Oh, like this. Okay, 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 I get it, I get it. Here's a web game, awesome. I prefer web games the most. Um, okay, got it. I forgot any explanation. What's the problem? Hold on. Sorry, my heater was making a weird noise. Um, yeah, I don't quite get what I'm doing. They damage 10 badges. Badges are like health. Okay. I'm a... Okay. 
They're a bit like health. I don't quite know what you mean. Oh. Do I have to shoot the bandage? Oh, I can jump as well. Cool. It's kind of like a Mario Galaxy. Like rings and Sonic. I don't I haven't played Sonic. I don't quite get it. Am I just trying to avoid the? Uh, am I just trying to avoid avoid the needles? Is that, is that what I'm trying to do? Is that all I'm trying to do? It's just avo avoid the needles. I believe so. Right. Okay. Cool. Uh, yes, and click the bandages. Okay. Got it. Okay. Yeah, it's a cool start. Uh, I would like to see where it goes. Uh, read the problem text on the left side of the screen and submit your answer to the right. Okay. Okay. Are these going to be like code questions? <laughs> okay. Password in plain sight. Okay. Oh, it's like, it, it's, it's like, uh, like the impossible quiz. I really just kind of like Google. Okay. You can scroll. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Okay. The sentence is a small. Okay. Okay. Uh, varying capitalization. The ca ca word of capitals. Wait. Okay. The side entrance has a small keyboard with a scrap of paper taped to its corner. Got it. this paper has many characters varying in capitalization. The back of the paper has the word capitals. It is definitely a good game. Yes, I can tell by the buttons. Um, your best guess is that the word is all all the capital letters in the on the paper. As an example, and shown to the right, if the scrap paper contained that, only looking at capital letters, it spells open. Okay, yeah. Um. Okay. The order you can solve this using what order method. Okay, cool. Um, okay, my first thought it would be O of N. Uh, just you know, loop through the array and uh, just if, if it's capital, um, append it to like a temporary array and that's where you're gonna return, right? Um, that's the best thing I can think of right now is, is O of N time complexity. Um, all then space, I guess, as well, depending on how big the word is. Yeah. Um. Okay. So do I write it in Python or like what? What's what's up with this? I could be wrong. Could there be a better way to do this? I wonder. Why would you, why would you want an O of N squared answer if you can solve it in O of N? Okay, so is is the most efficient way O of N? Is the most efficient way O of N? Yeah, is is the most efficient way O of N? Or is there some magical way to do this in 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 log N? I don't I don't believe so, because you have to have it. You have to have this be sorted. That's the problem. Okay, okay, yeah, because if this, if this order didn't matter, you could, like, I don't know, yeah. How many learn Godot like a pro? I'm so stuck on basic cube. Uh, don't follow tutorials, like big tutorials. Only follow really, really short little ones, only when you're stuck. If you're stuck, don't instantly look for a tutorial. Try to figure it out by yourself. Make a project. Always... Make a project. Make multiple projects in Godot. If you make multiple projects, you can learn that way. Watch Jiwas, but only when you need to. I like yes. Watch me. Give me views. That'd be great. But yeah, well, I don't. I don't like only follow the Jiwas tutorials. But if you have to follow tutorials, only follow tutorials like mine that are really yeah. Join lots of game jams. Uh, watch only very short tutorials. Only if you need to try to solve the problems on your own preferably look at the documentation. So if you're stuck first, go to the documentation, try to get what you need from the documentation. Worst case scenario, you need to go 
to a YouTube video. Um, but never watch like how to make this game in Godot. Don't watch that because uh, that won't teach you anything, and you'll you'll always be stuck in what's called tutorial hell. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna code this really quickly. Uh, I assume I can just write the function, right? I assume I can just write the function. Uh, yeah, it's uh, it's nine forty three right now, so it's not bad. Uh, I'll do, I'll just call it uh, find capitals, right? Just submit your answer. Oh, okay. So like, um, okay. So I guess just use a for loop through the list, uh, push to return array. I code an ID, cool, I will. Um, push to return array, push to return array, only capitals. That, that's basically it. You copy the real input and solve it there. Okay. Like this real input? Okay, cool. Wait, I'll copy it. Hold on. I got a ping. Oh, hold on. I got a message request. Okay. I'll check it out in a second. Okay, okay, cool. Um... Oh, uh, here's a new file. Uh, this is a lot of work for such a little question. Um, capitals, capitals. Cool, save. Oops. There we go. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, def capital, uh, I guess just find capitals, pass in nums, uh, for, uh, so I'll do, uh, results. It's an empty array for n in nums. Uh, I guess I'll do for i in nums since like, Wait, these are letters, my bad. Letters. I don't know why I call them nums. Uh, for... L in letters. If... L... Dot is... Wait, I think it's is L... What's the... What's the... Plugin? What's the... What's the, uh... uh check if L num python. If L dot is L num, is that not a thing? I believe so. Wait, no, uh, check if capital letter Python, it's not L num. Oh, that is upper, is upper, is upper. My bad. It's upper. Got it. Um, uh, Result dot append L and then just return results, right? That's all that is, I think. And then we're just going to print find capitals letters. Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. Wait, do I have to put is 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 uh, is upper? No. What? What? Why is this not working? Do we do like a list of a string? Is that how I have to do it? Do I have to convert this to a list? God, Python. Uh, loop through string Python. Hold on. Do I have to convert it to a list? I I feel like I do. 
No, I don't. What? What's the point? Four L and numbers. Let's uh, let's just print L. Let's see if that works. I'm looking like an idiot here. Uh, I'm a software engineering student. Currently, I'm mean, currently in my software year. A uh, soft sophomore software sophomore year. You put brackets around the string. Right, 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 right. Shut up. Shut up. Uh, I think it's, uh, I think it's result plus gets. I think that makes it a string. Hey, we got it. Let's go. Woo, yay. We got it. All right. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, because originally, uh, because a lot of the, like, legal problems I've been working with, um, hey, they're, they're, they're with nums, so, like, yeah. They're, like, with nums, so. I'm also still, like, kind of, I'm not super great with Python, because Python has, like, a lot of, like, weird little things with it. But we're getting there. Now for the real quick. Oh, boy. Where, where's that at? Where's that at? Where's the real input at? How do I find that? Uh, yeah, I am. This is, uh, this is Think With Games. Currently. Where's the real input at? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Alright. This, uh, it, okay. I don't know if it is. It, just in case if it's inappropriate, I'm gonna run it off screen and I'll show it. Hold on. Okay, it's a bunch of random. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, it is cool. Yo, thank you so much, Jim Mason. Appreciate it. Happy Tuesday, man. Thank you so much. Can you check my mini game I made for the for a jam? Yeah. Uh, can you send it in? Uh, can you send it in uh, Jewish showcase? D dude, I swear to God, Jim Mason. I, I feel like you've I feel like you've donated a couple times. Dude's like my sugar daddy. I pre appreciate it, man. <laughs> um, thank you so much. Um, I feel like you've, I feel like you've, you've you've done supers a bunch. I could be wrong. I really appreciate it. Uh, where is it? Yeah, yeah. Okay, you've done two. Okay. Still though, awesome. W W person, you know. You are a W person. Um, okay, did you send it? And, uh, the G was showcase. Uh, are, are you on my server, Merrick? Okay, okay, uh, I'll look at it. I have to accept your message request. I saw that. Okay, okay. I'm well, not sure if the Windows builds will work. Uh, have you watched my EXE tutorial? I have one. It's not that bad. Nope. Okay. Uh, you should join my server. And uh, once you do that, send over the link. And then yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah. So on um on my server here, I'll, I'll go show you. So oh my god, we're dude, we're two. We are two members away from 500 members. That's pretty good. You can put the answer. Okay. Yeah. yeah hold on. Uh, does that go? Is, is this connected to like network or something? Or how, where does this go to? That's incorrect. What do you mean by that's incorrect? Oh. Oh. My bad. I gotta copy this, right? Okay. Next puzzle. Cool. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. Yo, we are so close, guys. We are so close to 500. No way. Uh, but yeah, so, um, in Jiwa's stuff, go to Jiwa's showcase, and that's where I'm playing them. Okay. Yeah. Yo, what's up, Damo? Are you, uh, are you Dom in my, in my server? You could be a different one. I don't know. You enter a, into a factory. There's a box labeled Robot Assembly Kit just inside the entrance. Awesome. Welcome. Uh, 
A complaint letter is on top of the box saying that one of the, the top pieces is missing. Okay. I want to I, I want to try this one. I want to see what this is. Uh the instructions are still inside the box. Flipping through the pages, it sounds like all the pieces are labeled starting from 1 and count up sequentially to the last piece. The last piece is the head of the robot. And you can clearly see that piece is present. Perhaps this robot could be a nice component. Okay. As an example, if the instruction is contained, the highest number of the list is six. The only number from one to six that is not present in the above is four. Okay. Got it. There's a couple ways we could do this. So my first thoughts. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, so go to um. Where is it? Go to um. Uh, Jewish stuff and go to Jewish showcase. Jewish stuff and the Jewish showcase. It's right below the the GM stuff. Uh, okay. So my first thought, I could be wrong. Uh, I'm gonna convert this since all the numbers. I assume all the numbers are always gonna be unique. I'm gonna convert this to a hash set. All right, I'm gonna convert this to a hash set, so that way we can sh uh, search in O of one, like a constant time. We can search in O of one. Um, so I'm gonna convert this to a hash set, and then ah, I don't know. Oh, okay, so the highest number of the list is six. The only number from one to six that is not for, okay, okay. Got it. Hmm. Okay. This one's a bit harder. Okay. Um, that could be wrong. So we have the final one, which is not included. Okay. Interesting. I don't want to search multiple times. I want to find an efficient way to do it. Hmm. Can we sort it and then do binary search? Would that be a better way to do it? I could be wrong. Maybe we should sort it. And then we do a binary search. Appreciate it. Think with the games. Are you still are you still in the chat? Yo, thanks, Selma. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. No problem. That could work. Uh, the, okay. What's the... Okay, give me a hint. What's the targeted time complexity? What's the what's the targeted time complexity? I I feel like if we, if we sort the list, that would be n log n. And then searching it would be log n. Through sorting overrides the benefit true true that's right that's yeah that's what i was thinking because it would it would the n log n would trump the log n yeah okay okay oh wait i have an idea Convert it to a hash... Yes. Convert it to a hash set. And then... Okay. And then... And then, I guess... I don't know. Okay. I feel like a hash set is definitely involved. I know that you could... Okay. So... Am I correct in saying that we don't know what the missing number is, right? We don't know what the missing number is. Since we obviously know that one's here. Okay. Hmm. I believe we have to use a... Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, okay. We don't know the missing number. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um... Yeah. Okay. I feel... Okay. Hmm. The highest number in the list is six. Yeah. 
And also, the list can be any size, correct? The list can be, you know, the list can go on forever, uh, I believe. I feel like I'm in an interview. Um, so, the list can be any size. It's obscure, but I want to, I, I, I definitely want to figure it out. Yeah, I really want to figure it out. Um, well, so we should get the size of the array. I feel like that could definitely help. I don't feel like we, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to do it like a mock interview. I've never actually done an interview. I've only like watched mock ones before. So I'm trying to do it kind of like one. So I'm still not quite at the point where I'm interviewing. I mean, I'm interviewing in the fall. So I'm still studying the code. Um, hmm. Okay. Okay. So if we do two, one, six. Okay. <laughs> Mm. I know we can do it in all fun, but like, I feel like we could do it better. Can I get a hint of how to do it in all one? Potentially. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Good idea. So we'll start with the brute force solution. Um, got it. Uh, okay, let's do nums. Get three, six, two, one, five. Def find missing, I guess we'll call it. Find missing number, num, pass nums. Okay. And then we will do, okay. Got it, great. Yeah, I will check it out. Right after uh, this, right after, right after we figure out this, and I will I will check out your game. Um, okay, but we'll do. So, hmm. okay, so I will do. Num set will get, will convert nums to a set. All right, I think that's how you do that. And we'll do, um, for I in range zero to LEN nums minus one. What's the length of ones? Oh, okay, we'll do. Actually, no. I think I have an idea. I think of like a weird idea of how to do this. Okay, so. Okay, um, so obviously the length is going to be less than this. Okay, is the length... Okay, okay, wait. Is the length of the list always going to be one less than the maximum number? Am I correct in that? Is the length of the list always going to be... So, let's say if this list is... This, yeah. Okay, okay. It's always going to be one less. That makes sense. Okay. That's huge, actually. Um, so I think I think that that's gonna be good. Okay. Um, so we'll do. We can use a stack for this. Actually, you know what? We could do a stack. And we can every time we get one of these numbers, we could pop it from the stack. Thank you so much, uh, Merrick. Um. Every, yeah, every time we, I'm going, I'm going on so many tangents. Um, every time we, I'm really tired too. So 
every time we find him, we could pop her from the stack, right? So, we don't need this, actually. Do Python... Do these just work like stacks? I assume they could. That might be time hog, though. I could be wrong. I don't know. Nums dot pop. Let's just pop I. I don't know. Let's just uh. Let's just do uh. Let's just do that. Does that work? I don't know if that works. Um. Return nums. Yeah. So my logic for using stack is. If we have found the number in the stack, oh wait, no, my bad. I I was thinking, I was thinking it would result in a leftover number. But you're you're right, it wouldn't. Okay, 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 okay. So that wouldn't work, right? Um, okay, okay. Each is each number. Yes, yes. Each number is unique. So yes, I I do like where pack that guy's going. Where we can add all of them together. Okay, I have an idea. So we'll get we'll we'll do. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to call this. Let's just do. Um. Num pool. I don't really know what to call this. It will. It, this will get. The length of nums? Hell yeah. Um, oh. I mean, you can still, you still have time to like make something, you know? Oh, so. Okay. Um, so the length of this would be... So the target size... The target... Um, Yeah, but that would be all of n squared, you know? We can quickly we can quickly just build out a stack that has all of the numbers in it, you know? I don't know. We can quickly loop through four uh i in wait, yeah, so four. Yeah, so for I in range 0 to len nums minus 1. Wait, actually, just len nums. Because it's going to be 1 above it. We'll just do... Um, I don't know, just, let's just do nums stack. So we'll get that, I think it is. Or do I have to call stack? I don't, I don't know how that works. Okay. Numsec dot push i. And then here we will do numstack dot pop i. And then we return numstack. This could work. What is the stack all gonna do? So we're gonna build out a stack that has that has all the numbers including the missing one. We're gonna build the stack. Okay, okay, yeah, that could be work. Yeah. So my stack logic is we're gonna build out we're gonna build out a stack that has all of these numbers plus the one that's missing, just simply by iterating through the length of the nums. Um, because the length so length is one, two, three, four, five. So I believe it will be plus one. I could be wrong. And then if we print find missing num. In nums this is probably gonna give an error because I don't know how to use stacks in Python. Yep, okay. I guess I'll append.
Was it Lupin? What was your? X is not in the list. Okay. Cool. Yeah, it would be four. Yeah. It would be four. <sighs> okay. Um, for I in range zero. Okay. Oh my god. So I don't know this in one. I feel so stupid right now. It's not even funny. Oh my god, we hit 500. Let's go! But this isn't even funny how, how bad I am at this right now. Um, okay. Is your range starting at the right number? Yeah, I believe so. Oh, let's just do, let's just do this, you know. It could be, it could not be. It, oh, it's not inclusive, that's right. Ugh. Is it, is it that it's not inclusive? No, it's not, what? Here, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go print I. Print I. Let me just do that real quickly. Okay, it is, it's starting at zero, right? And then we need to end. And ends at five. That's correct. Right, that's correct. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Right. Right, 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 right. Okay. Uh, four and in nums. Uh, nums stack dot remove n. Uh, Wait, true spec. Missing numbers. Yes, we have five hundred. Amazing. X on list. What do you? What do you, what do you oh. If n is in num stack. Wait, wait. Nope. Mm -mm, nope. We're not doing this. Uh, we're gonna do. A couple things. We're gonna convert this nums. We'll get oh wait, yeah. Uh, num set. We'll get set nums. I think. And then if n if n is in num set. If n is not in num set. Right, right, right. Return n. None. Okay, cool. Amazing. And no, I'm sick. My bad. My bad. Okay, okay, there. That's the output. That's the output. That's the output, right? This is a stupid solution. I could be wrong. So... We we make a stack of all of the numbers. Or I guess I guess this is just an array at this point. This is even really a stack at this point. Um, num lists, I guess. I don't know. I guess num lists, right? This could be the method. So basically, what we do is we have we have a list of numbers that is all of these, including one, in in order. And this is technically O of one, uh, O of n. This is this is O of n. This is O of n, right? So we do all of all all of uh, all the nums in, in the uh, well, I guess it's O of n times times two or whatever. I don't know. Um, then so we we make a list of all the numbers, right? And then we so we make that list, and then we also convert this to a hash set so we can search in in constant time. With we could just check if it's in there. What's the time and space? So the so the time is n times two, I believe. It's n times two, and then the space is also O of n. Space is also O of n. What can I do? What can I be doing better? What can I be doing better here? 
because yeah wait i know i know what we could be doing better i i never mind no sorry i know i know what we could be doing better here i i answered my own question uh for uh i in range i'm so stupid i don't know what we could be doing better here um nums len nums plus one that's what we could be doing better here that's what we could be doing yeah let's go boys Yeah, okay. That's what we could be doing better here. Sure, what's the... Uh, but is, is is this good? Yes, is this good? Uh, think with games. Is, is this a good solution? I know that there's a constant one. Okay, okay, this is, okay, cool. That took me a while to figure out. I'm sorry about that. I've been streaming for a while. Um, it's also really hot in here. I'm making all these excuses. Okay. What's the actual solution if you... Uh, share to, if you care to share. It's the actual solution. And I gotta check out, uh, what's this, uh, Merrick's Games. Uh, cause that's O of N. Uh, that's actually, that might be more than O of N. Bit me open. I haven't learned bit manipulation yet. I'm not quite there. I know what that is. I've heard of that, and I'm not quite there. What's up, Elop? How you doing tonight? Welcome back. Max is over. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. 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 Max is over. Yeah. Yeah. My bad. Yeah. It is. But yeah, that's why. That's why. No, there's no real point. Uh, I don't know what the type of OC is to convert it to a set, but it's definitely worth it for searching. Yeah, I don't know bit manipulation yet. <laughs> I'm still not quite there. Um, I, I follow Neat Code. I don't know if you know who that is. Okay, okay, okay. So would would you accept this in an interview? Is my question. Even though this is this is a too easy of a question. That I would assume would be an interview. Would you accept this? Okay. 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 But do you think that that is worth it for the searching? Do you think that converting it to a set is worth it? Okay. What, what, what would you would you think that converting to because it speeds up searching so much, right? I believe it would be worth it. I could be wrong. Because I, I think searching would just be O of N. So the, I, I think without doing that, it would be O of N squared, right? Okay, yeah. I think it'd be O of N squared, which is nuts. And it's also O of N time, uh, O of N space complexity. So. Actually, no, it's not. No, it is. Yeah. It is. Yeah, so this is all This is all the space that we take up. This This is the This is the RAM um, right here. It's the, the memory... Um, that's, that, that, that's, that's linear. Okay. I can't believe we passed 500. That's crazy. This is an O of N squared. What do you mean? I thought this was O of N times two. Not O of N squared. It was O of N squared. Yes, so we have 500. That's actually insane. Yeah, okay. Okay. It's like, I don't think it's squared. It would be squared if you were using the, the num set. Uh, if, you, if you weren't using this. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, cool. I'm glad I found a pretty, pretty efficient solution. I'm pretty happy with it. Okay. I definitely gotta learn, uh, learn all the other advanced concepts. I'm I'm currently dabbling with like I mean I've learned a little bit about like uh like trees and graphs and stuff like that. I'm still working with stuff like that. I know some stuff. I've I've also learned more recently about two pointers. Like I know how to do uh binary search in like merge sort, which well, actually merge sort isn't two pointers, but I mean like I know how to do like binary search and stuff like that. Wait, is that two pointers? 
No. Right? No, it's not. Two pointers is like two some two on lead code. I don't know. I'm talking to my ass at this point. Sure, send me the real input. Oh, wait, no, my bad. I keep asking for that. I don't know why. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. My bad, my bad. Oh, boy. <sighs> Can you convert this to a list for me? <laughs> Can you send this as, like, a list to me, please? I really don't want to add commas to every single one of these. That would be great. Oh, there's some commas. Do you parse it as a string? I suppose. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I could parse it as a string, but if you could, if you could send me it, it would be great. I will be right back. Yeah, I might. I might do that. We'll see. All right, Jesus is back. Um, yeah, let's let's just parse this. The best part is that it's still, it's still like every line. It's crazy. It's gonna take forever. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, okay, thank you so much. Um, you can send both the string. Where'd you send to? Where did you send it to? Did you send it to my DMs or no? Where did you send it to? Triple quote, okay. Oh, and YouTube. I don't see it. It might have blocked it. I don't know why. Okay. Let me just use triple quote. Okay. Okay, okay. We're gonna go with that. Okay. Okay, so um let's just let's make a parsing function. I'm just gonna make a quick little parse function. So parse nums. Um Result, we'll get an array for L for N in nums. Okay, wait, no. For N in nums, uh, if N is equal to that, a space, uh, should be indexed, right? Range zero and nums. Of course, okay. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Um, okay, hold on. Nums dot splits. L and the what do I put that in um do I put that in okay 
Does that work? I don't know. One. Is the answer one? I don't know. We'll see. Probably not. No, it's not. Okay, cool. Okay. Convert it to an int. Okay, 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 okay. Um, how do I do that? Uh, I think it's int. Or is it? I'm gonna look up. Convert to int Python. I think it's just like that, right? Just like that? Nope, okay. Right, right, right. Okay. Thank you so much, Emma. Uh, okay. So just... I don't know why I'm struggling so much with that. Uh, 18. Hey, let's go. Okay. Uh, I'm going to quickly check out um, Merrick's game. And I got to uh, stop streaming for the night because it's getting late. So, hell yeah. Uh, let's check out Merrick's game. And that will be the end. Thank you. It took way too long. No, it's not your fault. It is it is not at all your fault. That is my fault. Okay, this is really laggy. Uh, I don't know what's going on with that. It's really laggy. Hold on. Do I have hardware acceleration on? Or is there a way to download it? Oh. Uh, I mean, it would be, you know, what would be cool is if you like have a way to like, just put like leak code questions onto it. I don't know, you know, or maybe add, add, add a, add a code ID to it. Add, like add an ID to it. Add an ID to it. Um, that'd be cool. That would just be, you know, recreating leak code at that point. I don't know if, what the demand for that really is, but it is pretty cool. I think the problem right now is, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Also, make questions that, you know... You can't just get through by just reading the, the, the list, make it so you actually have to program something. Cause I could theoretically just like look through this and find the answer and not know anything about programming or anything and just find the answer. Um, but I don't know. Have you done an advent of code? It's kind of based on that. No, I haven't. Is that only during like holiday season or is that like any time? True, true, true. Now you really got to find the balance of like, you need like coding concepts to like be able to solve it by hand, but it's also just better to do it by hand. I don't know. Well, no, it's better to do with, like, the computer, right? So I gotta reset my browser. I can't look at chat right now. Um, hold on. I'm gonna code puts out new problems in December. Yeah, okay, I assumed it was, like, during the holidays. I'll have to check it out uh, later this year. Even though I'm probably gonna have to be done with leak code by then, because I have to do my interviews, like, in the fall. So, we'll see. I will definitely try though.
That would be just fun. Yeah, 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 true. I guess the larger the input. Okay. So the, the, the problem was I didn't have hardware acceleration on my computer. Okay. This reminds me of that one uh, Flash game. Uh, where like you like flip that like big like rectangle. This is pretty cool. This is a pretty cool idea. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what it's called. I gotta play that on stream sometime. I just gotta play a bunch of like flash games on stream sometime. That'd be pretty fun. Play a fun run. I love that. That was my favorite one. I didn't see that one. You have to send it. Yay. Okay, so you said the high score is 165. Okay, understood. Nice. Oh, okay, okay. Got it. Wait, oh, I reached the time limit? Wait, what? Okay. I got it. That's what this says. Oh, 170. Let's go. All right. 170. Is that it? Is that the high score? You got three lives? You can, yeah. Yeah. That's what I did. That that, that, that was the, that was the strat I came up with. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I didn't need to quit. Was there a quit button in the in the, uh, in the in the web version? There should be a quit button in the web version. That's just like that's a that's like a nitpick. Oh, that was bad. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Oh, uh, check out my tutorial. I have a couple tutorials on it. I have one on EXE, one on Android, one on, um, I think, Mac. I don't have Linux yet. I got to do one on Linux. Linux is pretty easy, though. Well, I missed it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Okay, I lagged there a bit. That was weird. I, like, jumped. Okay. Pretty cool. Um, I beat the high score, so that's all I need to do. Okay. Uh, thank you, everyone, for tuning into this stream. Um, thank you for 500, uh, Discord members, which is probably gonna drop down a bit after the jam, but we're still, like, right around there. Awesome. Okay, I will, I will have to check those out. Um, but all right. Thank you guys for tuning in. Um, I don't know when the next stream is. I kind of just do this randomly, uh, but happy G was anniversary, everyone. Well, well G was anniversary Eve. That's what this is. This is tomorrow. So goodbye everyone. Bye-bye.